Hey, Internet, it's RJ. Welcome back. Thanks for tuning into the show today. In today's episode, we have $50 up for grabs, compliments of Spruce. So, of course, in typical fashion, we will talk about Spruce. It's a silly name, but the money's still the same. So, we'll talk about this offer, terms and conditions, requirements, and eligibility. Everything you need to know to make this $50 become your $50. So, of course, if that sounds interesting to you, then go ahead, press the subscribe button, and let's get to work. So, when it comes to it, I've actually done this one myself. So, there will be a data point section where we spend a little bit of time at because they do give us some hints into how we can make this a little bit easier for us. Uh, this is not a referral offer, so there will be a direct offer link down below, your first pinned comment, and in the description as well, just gets you where you need to go the fastest. Um, so when we get into it here, let's take a look at the offer to get started. Now, as we must mention, as always, um, there are no happy people. I mean, there's like a happy little celebration, you know, emoji down there. So, I mean, I guess that counts. It's not attached to a person, but, you know, I guess you don't have to talk to anybody. But anyways, that's not why you're here. You're here for this $50. So what do you need to do to get this $50? Well, it's actually pretty easy. So open a new Spruce spending account. That's basically a checking account. It's like a Neo neo fintech ish type bank i think it's owned by h and r block actually but spruce spending account same thing as a checking account then you need to direct deposit 200 dollars within 45 days of account opening now if you pay attention to this middle section here this is going to come in handy when we get to the data point section that's why i'm including it so they say direct deposits that qualify are ach credits including direct deposits, but not tax refunds, which is odd because they belong to H&R Block, I believe. Uh, mobile check deposits, internal transfers, transfers within Spruce from external accounts or cash transfers. So we're going to want to pay attention to that ACH credits um, piece in a, in a second when we get to the data points. And of course, this is going to be valid through June 30th of 2023. So overall, opening this one is pretty straightforward. Uh, they do have a, you can do it through the app or through online, which is helpful. Again, just through that direct offer link. Opening it really didn't take that long. Pretty straightforward. There's only one account option anyways, which is that spend account. Again, I do believe it's related to H&R Block. But again, if you've used H&R Block before, like that's fine. You would still you know, be eligible for this as we'll see when we jump into our eligibility section. So we'll talk about the direct deposit in a second when we get to the data point section. And I can show you my own as well as some other folks who have, who have I've talked to who've done this as well. Now, uh, with eligibility, as we just said, this is going to be a nationwide offer and new customers only. Again, it has affiliation to H&R Block, but uh, it, it's, it's a different product, so you should be fine if you've done it in the past. Uh, there are no fees associated to this one, which is really good as you'd like to see with this. And they don't have any account closure rules listed you know, there's no referral bonus to this. This one screams like an account that will have a referral bonus in the future. Uh, so for me, I'm probably going to leave it open for a little bit just to see uh, since it is new customers only, but you don't have to keep it honestly if you don't want to. So overall, I mean, really, that is what you need to know about this is pretty straightforward and to the point down, you know, with these, a lot of times there's not a lot of easy data points out there because you know most of you guys some of you even rolling your eyes now these $50 offers but that's fine because it's still $50 it's still easy enough and it's even better because I did it so I can be the data point for us so that's where we will go next so I'm gonna put it on screen for you this is my data point this is a screenshot from my shop from my account so you can see March open the account um, at March 27th. That was a $200 transfer from Chase. I wanted to see if it would work because if you go back to the terms and conditions or the, the, the direct deposit conditions, it doesn't outright say external transfers, but I think I did this one the wrong way. We'll talk about that in a second. So if you go to the one above it, March 28th, um, unemployment benefit from the state of Michigan. It's a long story, just stay in school, kids. But uh, the point you want to pay attention to is um, that one says ACH credit next to it. And then the transfer from Chase obviously says transfer. Now they both say income underneath it. Uh, so the thing they're looking at is that ACH credit line. Now, the reason I say the transfer from Chase may or may not have worked is because I think I believe I pulled that money from initiated the transfer on Spruce's side. However, if you were to push the money from Chase or another bank, I'm willing to bet that would probably show up different as an ACH credit since they do mark it as income. So that's why I wanted to note that. But if we get back on track here, you can see again, March 28th, it was completed. And then April 11th is when the bonus paid that $50. So pretty quick turnaround. So again, they coded that as income as well. 
but uh, overall pretty quick turnaround. Now just sticking with this for a second, uh, one thing I did learn when I did this was that you can't transfer money from Spruce to external accounts. Even though my Chase account was linked through Played or Plaid, however you want to say it, when I signed up, I went to move out the money. Didn't work. That's why you see those Ally micro deposits in there so I could link my Ally account and pull the money out. Transfers do take a while from this bank too, from what I can tell. So just be aware of that. But overall, quick turn time. Um, so because of that, that ACH, why I'm harping on that is because very rarely do they tell us what they're looking for. A lot of times we have to guess, does it say, you know, PPD? Does it say payroll? Things like that. What counts, what doesn't count. But what I believe you're looking for is your transfer to say ACH credit, uh, which if you can get it to say ACH credit and be marked as income, I believe, you know, you should be good. And you can also see the time frame from when they pay. So if you do something and it doesn't pay in like two weeks, then you might want to try something else. I had another gentleman I was talking to in our, our channel member discord, who used Wise. Wise is like a payment platform system. You can just basically send yourself like as you, you were paying payroll. And that did work as well. He actually got his like maybe a few days before me. And it also showed up as that ACH credit. So I do think a lot of different things will work if you want to do this, which again is good because for $50, a lot of you probably don't want to tie up, you know, a direct deposit or something like that. But if you can spoof it, um, all the better. And this one, I think you can overall pretty good there. So that is the data point for this one. Of course, if you have anything different that works easier, feel free to drop that down below. Uh, but now let's move on to the summary slide here to bring us home. So again, when we take a look at it, the target is Spruce. You're going to open up a spending account. It's the exact same thing as a checking account. This is going to be nationwide. You're picking up $50 for doing it. What do you need to do? Again, just direct deposit $200 within 45 days of opening the account. There are no fees. Uh, you can feel free to shut it down. Again, I when they don't have a shutdown rule, I tend to say at least wait 90 days just as to not anger anyone or try to get something clawed back. But overall, um, that, that is everything you need to know about Spruce. Pretty easy and to the point. But of course, if Spruce is not for you, then it's time to plug some stuff. And I would direct you to ProfitableContent.com. That is the channel's blog where we post not only all the latest bank account bonuses, we have some credit card offers, and we have the latest news stories as well. It's always linked on the main channel page and down below for you. If you are interested, you can surely find something to hunt until your heart is content. Um, one other thing, I also did mention the channel members page. If you click the join button down below, it will give you a quick synopsis of like what we're doing with the channel memberships. Uh, it's between this channel and the other channel, the credit card channel, which I call the main channel as well. You get access to the channel Discord, and then you can talk about things like this, uh, referral links, um, getting your referral links and videos and blog posts, things like that. So if you want to play on expert level, that's why it's called Profitable Content Pro, uh, feel free to click that join button down below. I know I plug a lot of stuff, but at least I leave it to the end of the video after I've told you everything you need to know. So anyways, guys, that's that is going to be it for Spruce. Again, pretty easy, $50. So, of course, if you like this one, drop me a thumbs up down below. If you found it particularly interesting, consider subscribing to the channel because we're posting content just like this every week on how to make banks money become your money. And of course, every single day on ProfitableContent.com. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you very soon in the next one.